Hi, and welcome to Review the Requirements. So it's important when we make a website that we actually review the requirements of the website or what we need to make. Um, and there's a couple of reasons for this. First one is to know what is required of the, the website. So what does the client actually want us to do and make? Um, second is to actually confirm with the client that you know what is required. So instead of just knowing what to do, it's also important the client knows that you know what to do. And so you ask questions and you check details to make sure that um, there's been no misunderstandings. Uh, and so the process, uh, it can be a formal process in terms of uh, like sit down meetings and um, formalized documents and that sort of thing. It can be a very informal process um, or it can be a mixture of the two. So generally you would prefer a formal process um, because then it has, um, it's a lot easier to to work out exactly uh, what the client was asking for and then deliver that. Uh, and then if there are any disagreements at the end, it's a lot easier with that formal paperwork to then um, solve those disagreements either through negotiation or um, if all else fails, a legal argument. Um, but it depends on the, the type of developer you are, the type of project that you're doing. Um, obviously a bigger project would be more likely to have a formal process than a smaller project. And that is review the requirements.